Cooper, our first performer. This is Snake. <laughs> Song from uh, 1957. It was written by a guy named Ewan McCall. He was a Scottish folk singer. And at this time he was traveling with, uh, collaborating with, performing with a young lady, because she was young then, named Peggy Seeger. Pete Seeger's sister. Now he was 20 years older than she, so it became a real big scandal when their collaboration turned into something a little, a little more uh, friendly. Big scandal. Not so much because he was married, but because he was so much older than she. He wrote this song for her, and everybody knew that he wrote it for her because he admitted it. But he tried to walk it back by saying she needed a song for a project she was working on, so he wrote it, you know, with only that in mind. And um, not many people bought it, but his wife did. So he stayed married for several more years, had another baby. Ultimately though, he did get divorced and he did marry Peggy, so he didn't stay married to her until he died at the age of 89. She, by the way, is still playing at the age of 88. I hope I can come close. The first time ever I saw I thought the sun rose in your
relationship that works, or at least it works for family savior. Not so much for you and McCall's wife. Here's a song about a relationship that didn't work. It's from 1964. It was written by a fellow named Tom Paxton. So that's too late for the learning made of sand, made of sand.
is a song from 1999. by a guy named Daryl Scott. It's a song about some of his four days. He came from Appalachia, a place called Harlan County, Kentucky. Harlan County is in the heart of the coal country. Only the industry they have there is coal. And I spent almost 30 years in the underground mining business, and I have coal in my blood, so the song speaks to me. <laughs> In the deep dark hills of Eastern Kentucky is the place where I trace my bloodline, and it's there that I read a few sad stories. Well, my grandfather's daddy came down, yeah. in his heart, took Tilly Hilton for his bride, said, walk with me now, Oh, I love you. Till a man from the northeast arrived, with an hundred dollar bills, said, "I'm here for you, guys." But he never left home. Grandma sold a cheap and moved out west of Hartford to a farm where the rich land river won. I bet they danced them a jig and laughed and sang them a song. Who said we'd never leave Hartford? Well, the times they got tough, tobacco wasn't selling. Grandpa did what he had to to save When Doug Harlan Cole sent the money back to Grandma, and he never left Harlan alive. Sun comes up about ten in the morning. Sun goes down. 